Hi, my name is Kath Leslie from Alternative and Physiotherapy and we're doing a newsletter at the moment about patellofemoral or kneecap pain. So we're going to do a series of videos which will um, help to strengthen the core, which is the abs and the glutes, and then um, strengthen the quadriceps, the muscles down the leg, and then some stretches. So our first video is core exercises. There's three of these exercises. I'm going to start off lying down on my back and we're going to start off with our glute bridge. This is going to strengthen the bottom muscles and the abs as well. So if you have a soft ball you can use that but equally you can use uh, you can do the exercise without. Bring the feet a teeny bit towards your bottom, switch your tummy muscles on, the deep tummy muscles and soften those ribs. And you want to just gently flatten the back, peel the vertebra off, and push those knees away towards the opposite side of the room. Come back down, one vertebra at a time. So with the ball, you can activate the glutes a little bit more. So you can gently flatten, and then come up to the top. You'll feel those bottom muscles working, those deep tummy muscles working, and then back down. If you get a little bit of cramp in the hamstrings, then just stretch those out in this position as well. Then come into side lying. We're going to work on our um, side glutes. Really important when you've got knee pain, the muscle here is the important one. So you want your feet, your bottom and your shoulders all lined up. You don't want too much bend in those knees because you want to isolate this muscle just behind the hip bone. Keep the feet together and take that knee up out to the side. You're looking for this muscle to do some work. So you should feel that working just behind the hip bone. If you're struggling to find that working, pop a pillow between your knees, maybe even lengthen the feet a bit further away, and then you're just working slightly more in the inner range, and it's a bit easier for that muscle to understand what it needs to be doing. Then, our final one is our side kick, which is about glute max, the big muscle at the back. For this one, you lift the leg to hip height, you fold forward so the knee comes towards your chest and you're bending at the hip. Then you take that knee parallel to the ground all the way through the movement and extend through that hip. Lovely stretch here, big muscle at the back doing some work. Fold forward and back. Keep those tummy muscles working so the back doesn't arch. And you want to think about doing 10 of each of those exercises, really thinking about the muscle that you're trying to isolate with each exercise. Thank you.